It's the mindset. Free your mind. Free your mind. Mindset. Free your mind. Free your mind. Hey, not everything that glitter is gold. Everything that's white is snow. On the mindset, I just start. Let them know. Let them know. Let them know. Oh, words from the wise. I just star, we will never die. Stand tall, we will never die. We'll forever shine. I just star, shine like the star in the sky. Some hate, some love. Blessed love, pleasant, good afternoon. Warm welcome, mindset program. I just star. I'm your host, and I want to greet you in the divine name of His Imperial Majesty, Ayla Selassie I the First. Another day above ground, I will give him thanks and praise for our ultimate position, which is life. Zain, and not no greater than that, no matter what I want. So give thanks. Um, this podcast is um, brought to the item by Black Star International Media over there in Houston, Texas. Zin, give thanks. And um, also Yard Slang Closing and Mindset Roots and Juice. Zin, yes, my people. So um, we are looking at three major brethren in the, um, in the music, reggae music. Zin, we are looking at three major brethren. All right. We are looking at Bounty Killer. We are looking at Cableton. And we are looking at Bujibantan. And there's a reason why um, we are looking at those three um, prominent, very talented, very influential artists within reggae music. Zin, and why? is a you know someone made a comment on a video that um I did recently it was two comments Zena Burgin named Rob Emily Zane and a, another Burgin named Noel James Noel James Zane so the Burgin um Rob, these are the comments where the virgin, um, the virgin make. The virgin say, the young youths them are find them footing. In time, them will mature just like Bujo back then. Keep stating the real truth, Rasta. Everyone have a right to listen what music they want. I remember the what is beginners in the eighties from reggae singers against the up and coming young dancehall youths. Zin, no. What I take from that comment is the fact that him talk about Bujo, that Bujo was a hardcore dancehall artist like um, enough of the youths them that we have at the dancehall today. Now, Bujo make a statement, um, we don't hear all of the interview, but basically what him say is that a rubbish or trash music, trash music, them I make as reggae and dancehall artists. Zane, trash music. And I think he was going right across the board. Now, we are doing this podcast here, and I don't want none of the artists them to take offense to where um, we are present right here. Zin, because it's not to um, bring down or put down anyone, any of these three artists, Zin, because I know these three artists, they are well respected, you know, worldwide, you know, have a lot of fans. You know, I listen to their music, I grew up listening to their, their, their music. 
You understand? And they're very influential and they do they do a lot of songs that I can relate to. Zane, these three artists, Bounty Killer, Capleton, and Buju Bantan. And the fact that the Virgin said back then, Buju used to do similar songs. We know Capleton also come from a uh, probably a, 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 a hardcore dance hall background also within the music. Zane? But we know Bunty Killer probably have started as a hardcore dance hall artist. Now, Bunty Killer hasn't changed from being a hardcore dance hall artist. He, that is him. He maintained that from start to finish. And him not finished yet. Zane, but he maintained that. Right? Along the way, him do a lot of good reggae songs. A lot of good reggae songs. Along the way. You know what I mean? Book, book, book. Um, old, old song, probably one of the songs where, 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 where them bunny even one of them songs. Anytime. You know what I mean? All but good songs the virgin do. But him still maintain him hardcore dance hall self. Now we do recent videos and where we mention the Virgin, Zane, along with young a younger artist, Jashi, Zane. And Jashi is one of them young artists there who probably are finding footing in the music and will mature at you know at some point. You see me I say? And probably change the content I music, who to tell? We hope so. You understand? We hope that that is the way it go. All right? We hope that's the way it go. Now, the Virgin said, Bujo used to do similar things. So, all right. Bujo did a song, Zin. As, as a as a hardcore dancehall artist back in the day, Zane, and we only we only I do this for educational purposes and for awareness. Zane, where the music is coming from, you see me? I say, and also where these artists are coming from because them artists are. I say certain things, Zane and, 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 and enough ones that I say, but when you used to when you used to do them thing and when you used to say them thing and Yeah. Them used to say them thing. Yeah. But them change direction and them, them change the content of the music where where where, where, where them are put out. Zane enough of them um outlook and appearance has changed and how them do things. See? Now, Buju did a song as before him came over to like, you know, the reggae side and, and, and being Rasta or Rastafari. Buju did a song say, Man for Dead. And if you look on the screen, you can you can see the thing um and the lyrics of the song on the screen. Zane, now I'm gonna read some of it. I'm gonna know wanna know the song. Zane. Now hear this. You are laugh when I laugh at people, man. We kill people 
and drink blood. Original Buju Bantan, Depan, them case, man. Show your face, rude boy. Aim now. All rude boy. Man for dead. Just make them know we not save no lead. Gunshot for bust up in a informer head. Man for dead. Jungle is not save no lead. Gunshot for bust up in a informer head. Them never hear. Them never hear what the general said. From a guy this the program him affi dead. Them could a light like a cock or heavy like lead. My four four magnum left them under my bed. I could a plea, them a plea or beg. Them a go beg. Man for dead. Just make them know we nah save no lead. Gunshot for bus up in an informer head. Now, that is a song from Buju Bantan. That is the lyrics. That is, that is the lyrics of a song. I don't know if Buju still performed that song. See? But I'm sure that song still play in the dance hall or in the parties, or, you know. I'm sure that song still play. See? No. Not for the songs them what the youths them are do today. They're very graphic. I'm probably more graphic than when we just read out Abuja lyrics. Zane, now Abuja say a trash music them I make right now. Not for the youths, them I don't know if he include himself in in in, in a hit. Zane, but would you consider this these lyrics to be trash? Also, because all it has say a man for dead. All it has say is man for dead. Zane, we know, of course, we know that the virgin is is um in probably nursing them song. You see me I say because we, we we know him is a rasta man. Zin, we know him the Rasta man. But the comment what the virgin make, I said back then, would you used to give the, um, do them sang the two until him find himself, till him get mature and stop make them type of song there. So you have to give the youths them space to find them footing. That is what the virgin are saying. Now. But hear what I say now. Hear what I say. We're not going to spoil the rod you now. We're not going to spear. We're not going to spoil the rod. We're not going to spear the rod and spoil the child. We're not going to spear the rod and spoil the child. That are the reality, you know. Because even though him might have done these songs and him say, yeah, probably them songs, yeah, him shouldn't even have done them songs. Yeah. But the reality is them sang I get them 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 do already and them out there and they can't read they can't take it back. Can't take it back, it's out there already. Zin. So we now go spear the rod 
and spoil the child. No way. Because we can see where the thing are going. We can see the direction in where the thing is going. See? So we're not, we're not going to do that. We're not going to see the boy, the thing are going down hill. And really and truly are uphill with, with, with your God. And we are going to continue to go down hill. And we know the boy, we can, we can, we can stop the thing and turn it around and, and, and start to go uphill. You see me, I say? Old some people for <laughs> ah boy. Yeah, we're not going to spoil the rod, man. We're not going to spare the rod and spoil the child. We ain't gonna do that. Zine, so I don't want no one to take this video the wrong way. Zin, because as me said, we're not going to spare the rod and spoil the child because the way the thing I go right and now. The virgin officer something. As him officer something, Maya. And not just go and say something, you know, you go and require action. Because action speak louder than word, you know. Yeah, action speak louder than word. That are the reality. So make we look upon um one of Bounty Killer songs. Zane, as we know, Bounty Killer is, is an out and out dancehall artist. Zane, out and out hardcore dancehall artist. So, people are going to say, boy, oh, you know, you nah, I expect no better. Why you yeah, use Bounty Killer? And you know, say, why? We don't nah use Bounty Killer. We just say, uh, Bounty Killer is just an example in a this in a this thing, seen as an influential elder in a the music right now, because that is what him is. He is an elder to a lot of these up and coming artists who are do the rounds right now. He is their elder. Zin also my elder. I'm sure he's older than I am. Zin. But this uh, this uh, this uh, this I want a bounty killer song. Zin, this I want a bounty killer song. Bounty killer say, gunshot attack them body like bees. Them a travel such such hard, never check them speed. Fly past. Things around and never look and read. When bad man arrive, a informer must leave. You don't know you were dead. About murder, a Steve. Say him a murderer, now him a beg man, please. And a bar like a baby, him dep on him knees. My big gun pop out and shot starts squeeze while gunshot a, a sting a sting boy body like bees. Hey boy, you're dead this time. Me have a gun, your name. See and blind are dead same time. That is a lyric from Bounty Killer. Now, Bounty Killer name speak for itself. You know, I could probably expect um, any different type of songs from Bounty, but of course, you know, Bounty do a lot of reggae songs that is very influential. Zane, that speak out to get a people, get a people can relate to what he's saying. A lot of these songs are influential songs. A lot of these songs that they do are, are motivational songs that motivate people to, to, to uplift themselves. Zane, 
So remember, you know, if those songs are motivational songs to uplift people and people uplift themselves, what about some of the weak minded people them, who go and listen to this song, Zane, and it go and impact their life in a negative way? Now, these are the type of lyrics and songs these younger youths that is doing the music today grow up on. Zane? Them grew up on Bojo, them grew up on Bunty, and them grew up also on Capitan. Because these are the three artists them we, 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 we are used as an example today. As I said, I don't want a man feel no way and feel like we are discredit them or we are trying to tarnish them or try to bring them down. No. Far from the truth. It's just based on the comments that come in upon this platform here. See? Now, from your youth, them say, you know, Capitan are one of the most um Slack artists. See? And we, 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 we hear a lot of slack songs. See? And when, them, when I think in a them day, the reason why them probably would have called, because people know, I don't think people call them slang the slack. Them slang there is some reality songs, really. But back in the days, because the thing had changed and it had evolved and the artists had come with them type of song there, Zane, enough people say a slack song, but it's actual things that are going on, what people do. Zane, man and woman, now, slack. All right. But when we really check and me, 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 me search to find out if Capleton was really doing some, some you know, degrading songs or some gun songs or, and really and truly me not come across none. Me not come across none, really. But me come across this song. Me come across this song. See? Where well, it's not a slack song. No, it's not a slack song. The song named Cold Blooded Murderer. Cold Blooded Murderer. Tell me, tell me, where uno require. Uno hear me? Cold Blooded Murderer. Should I have, you shouldn't have killed the innocent soldier. I tell them, I see weeping and mourning. I see everybody sad. Flames for the man them. Flames for the man them innocent blood them shed. No matter how them plea and no matter how them beg. Fool them up a copper. And X amount of lead. Who killed the innocent man? I go dead. No matter how them plead, no matter how them beg. Mama bun, bun, mama bun a dolly put, put her hand upon her head. Hold her belly and ball for her son. Cold blooded murderer. Shouldn't kill. The innocent soldier. Now, 
is an innocent man them kill you so and keep it on as a boy them shouldn't kill an innocent man. Any man who kill an innocent man, he may go dead. Fool them up a cap and lead. See? Fool them up a cap and lead. Now, is Capleton Deer promoting violence in him lyrics? Because the way I see that is like a defend him, a defend an innocent man with them leak down in the lyrics, in the song. Then, and you know, must be him. It can be someone else. He might talk about, I go fool them up a cup and lead. Obviously, it couldn't be him he might talk about. Is it me? But that song is a big song. Cold blooded murderer. He did that song, I think, after them, them, them murder panned. Zane, after them murder panned. Me dig, me dig, and me dig. I couldn't find no bad man song from Capleton. Oh, slack them say Capleton was and, and, and this and that as a, as a dancer. I, I couldn't find, I couldn't find any song. That was a derogatory song. I couldn't find any song. See? Now, these are three influential icons in the business. The youths, them, grew up on these three major Reggae and dancehall artists, music. See? Buju Bantana say it's trash music. I make now. And I feel like I know just know the trash music I make. Long time the trash music I make. I know just know. I know just the youth them today who are sing about certain things. But it's for the elders like the Bounty Killer, the Cableton, and the Buju Bantan. It's like them now who have experienced, who have done certain songs, who probably didn't understand or understand certain things, and them, them understand certain things and know certain things. Now, them not do them type of songs anymore. And them have to encourage the youth them in a the direction that them know them supposed to go. As we said, we're not going to spare the rod and spoil the child. No way. So I could look upon another comment. Zin, I could look upon Noel James' comment that he made upon the video that I did um, where Buju talk about trash music. Noel James said, everyone contributing to the degradation of the music Keep in making excuses about what people want to hear. No one has ever gone to any studio and tell the engineer what should be recorded. The artists doing the bad songs are not willing to take responsibility. The reason they don't accept the good music is because you provide them an alternative. Tell the truth that your fame and popularity is what is important and you want to eat a food of the trash thrones. No one in Jamaica like gun crimes, yet the most popular songs in Jamaica is the gun thrones, totally hypocrisy. How did the people get, to get, get so twisted in their mindset Music is an art influence, popular culture. Hence, the artists them have a responsibility 
They are sowing seed and creating legacy. Young children are looking up to them as well as their examples. The artists them cannot remain unaccountable. Our future and society hangs and in the balance in a serious way. These trash music have an impact whether the artists them believe so or not. The main reason for the, the decadence in Jamaica is because no one is taking any responsibility for the preservation of integrity. Parents are burdened with the moral contribution of artists who are more of more influence on what children are being exposed to. Enough of the parents them cannot manage because they are also struggling to put food on the table. I don't even think any artist consider is or herself accountable for society that they too are a part of. The attitude has to change. Our issues are real. Bless. That are where the virgin, the virgin has said. The virgin has said, ones don't want to take responsibility for their actions. See, the virgin said, ones must, 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 take, uh, must be responsible for the preservation of integrity. I found that very profound. I find that statement very profound. Zane, and we give thanks for, 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 for comments like these and, and there are others that we can pull up. Zane, but we're going to leave it right here for now. Zane, let me know your views, your thoughts in the comment section. Zane, it was nice um, reasoning with the item. Um, leave your comment and, you know, spread the word. Mindset, peace and love, manners and respect. Ja Rastafari. Smash that subscribe button. See, you on the next I just I got, got the, the mindset. mindset. Smash that subscribe, subscribe button. button. See you, See on, you the on the next video. video. I just I got, got the, the mindset. mindset.